What's up guys, it's Dave here with Airsoft GI and today we're giving you guys another info drop about BB Wars Operation Overlord October 28th at D14 Airsoft. Hint, hint, tickets on sale now. What we're talking about today is camouflage requirements. They are a little bit more strict this time than they've been in the past, so we wanted to make sure that you guys were all up to snuff on what they're going to be. For the Rebels, this is gonna be really simple. You guys just show up in what you wear around the house every day. Show up in your jeans, show up in your t-shirt, show up in your banana costume, we don't care. All as long as you don't wear anything camouflage. That means no camouflage pants, means no camouflage shirts. We request that you not wear any camouflage gear, but we're not officially banning it, so if all you got is multi-cam plate carrier, that's okay, we understand. Also means that your headgear has got to match. So, as long as you show up not wearing camo, you're good to go for the Rebels. Here's where this gets weird. At the last BB Wars, we allowed any kind of camo pattern for the Imperials. But because we want to make sure that the Imperials are looking extra fly, we have restricted your camouflage options to any green or green-based camouflage, although we're asking that you not wear any solid green because that's going to make the Rebels a little confused and their tiny brains can't handle it. And multicam. So that means multicam, like so. Woodland camo, like so. Regular tiger stripe, which is what I'll be wearing, is also going to be cool. And really, we want our Imperial guys especially to step it up in the costume game. And we thought, what better way to kind of set the bar than to dress up our own overlords? So right here, we've got our head tech Brian modeling what he'll be wearing at BB Wars. This is his overlord suit. For those of you who paid attention to our last video, you know that this game is all about these guys. Wearing the big old helmets, he don't feel a thing. Which means you can't kill him by shooting at him. You guys are gonna have to find some really clever ways around all of these restrictions. And you'll have to pay attention during the briefings because that's when we tell you how to take these guys out. One game it might be by throwing grenades at them. One game you may have to flank around and be able to melee kill him. One game you may just have to capture the building that controls what he's doing. It's all pretty simple stuff. But if you get caught in front of him, he's gonna hit you with one of these bad boys right here. So make sure you guys have the right camouflage requirements. Otherwise, he may shoot you when he didn't need to. And that's gonna suck for you because these mini guns hurt. Anyways, my name's Dave, this is Brian, our head overlord, and we will see you guys at BB Wars October 28th at D14 in Sanger, Texas. You guys can pick up your tickets now online at airsoftgi.com, or you can come down here to the store and grab them here as well. Hopefully we'll see you there. We thought we'd give you guys uh, a little bit of an example to follow here, and we decided to dress up our own overlords. Send in the overlords! Wait, where, Andrew. You're too small to be an overlord. Where's Brian? Go, go get Brian. You gotta be this tall to overlord, man. <laughs> Amateurs. <laughs>